Welcome back, everyone. This is Jeff with Nerve, and we are here for another episode of Tips and Tricks with Nerve Agent. Going to look at two new features in Agent 1.4, and that is overridable slot names and uh, the ability to put the uh, enable and disable buttons, which currently are over here. Uh, onto the grid itself. So let's jump right in. Um, these are feature requests from our Nebula users. Uh, I'm not using Nebula in this particular setup, but uh, let's go ahead and take a look at what this does. So we have Novel Tech Character on this slot. We can right click on that slot, say Set Custom Slot Name. We'll rename this now to Analog Emulation. Go to our passive EQ. We've got to enable that. Do. So easy enough, right? Go in here, rename this Rothschild. And so there we have it. Now we're back on the uh, live page and our slot names show whatever we want them to. And the next thing I'm gonna show you is quickly Let's go ahead into agent parameters, and most of you guys should know, but some people may have missed it. Um, we have all of the internal components that are in our routing. They're all available here. We're now adding the enable button into the uh, agent parameters as well. So we scroll down to the bottom, and I'm currently on the effects rack here. You can see that there. And I'm gonna go down to the effects rack, enable, right? ER1, enable, we drop that over here and come back to our live page. When I select that, you can see that our Novatech analog emulation gets disabled when we click on that. Um, come back over here, enable two as our passive EQ. All right, so there's two things that that does for us. Number one is it allows you to put that right by the, the group of controls that you want to control. Um, and number two, makes it a little easier to automate uh, if you have a hardware controller. Um, now you've got everything in one spot. So let's move this in here. Looks a little bit better. Um, anyway, that's it. Those are two new features in Agent 1.4. We'll be back. I've got another feature I want to show you guys. Um, that is uh, chain flipping. We'll do that in a separate video. This is a cool little feature that allows you to A, B separate chains inside of Agent. Um, bypass full chains. It's a, it's a nice feature for mastering especially um, or for live performance. We'll see you soon. Thanks for stopping by. <laughs>